Alrighty. Hello. Welcome back to the Deep Rock Galactic video. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna... Eh. Okay, there we go. Hello. Welcome back to the Deep Rock Galactic video, y'all. In today's video, I'm gonna be going on a Solo Has 5 mission here with Gunner, taking the Thunderhead as the primary and the Bulldog Heavy Revolver as the secondary. For the Thunderhead, I'm gonna be using Big Bertha as the overclock, and for the Bulldog's overclock, I'm gonna be using Magic Bullets. Before I get into how I have the guns built, if YouTube is recommending my videos to you guys, and you haven't already, maybe consider subscribing. I'd really appreciate it. It would help the channel grow. And I'd just like to have you guys along for the ride. So, how I have the Thunderhead built here is I have, for its gear modifications, more ammo, um, faster rate of fire, or faster rate of fire growth, um, even more rate of fire, our, uh, armor breaking in tier 4, and fear in tier 5. And, of course, I'm like I said, I'm, I'm going to be using the Big Bertha Overclock. So how Big Bertha works is it gives you a huge increase in damage and reduced base spread, but at the cost of um, less ammo in both magazine and the ammo capacity and a slower rate of fire. So for the Bulldog Heavy Revolver, uh, how I have it built here is in Tier 1, I have a faster reload. In Tier 2, more total ammo. Tier 3, bigger explosion. Or <laughs> Uh, in tier 3, I have explosive rounds. Basically, when I shoot this uh, into the ground, it'll create a small AoE explosion that'll damage the bugs. In tier 4, I have even more ammo. And in tier 5, I have neurotoxin, neurotoxin coating. Basically, this uh, will apply uh, a toxin effect to bugs uh, via either me shooting at them or me shooting near them with the help of explosive rounds. And then for the overclock, it's magic bullets. <laughs> magic bullets, what it does is basically it just, well, like magic, it makes your bullets ricochet off of surfaces and into nearby enemies. And you have a lot more ammo, but at the cost, you have a significantly decrease in damage. But that's okay, because with how this is built here, basically this is like an, uh, a crowd clearing build, mainly for grunts, that is. For my grenade, I'm using incendiary grenades. My shields are built with a faster recharge, zip lines have uh, more reach, Lloyd is all revised car grenades and electric bullets. I've never changed that. <laughs> Ooh, that's actually fun. You know what? Let's do this. Oh man, I'm almost a rank 400. Four levels away, dude. Holy crap. <laughs> this build um, is honestly really enjoyable. I really enjoy using Big Bertha a whole lot. Though, now that I've used the unstable, or not the unstable, yeah, I'm using one right now. Uh, though now I'm, I've tried out the balanced overclocks, the, what is it, combat mobility and the other one, carpet bomber. I think I actually enjoy using combat mobility more. I just like being able to run around. Ooh, I heard you. No! Let me go. Thank you. Run away. <laughs> yeah, guys, yeah. <laughs> oh man, get rid of those, those swarmers. Are they, um, what, what is it? No, no, they're not. It's so hard for me to tell uh, with the swarmers on radioactivity if it's a, uh, what is it called? If it's a brute nexus one or if it's a uh, 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 naturally spawned in one. Oh, meteor. What if the bugs could attack Molly and you had to like repair her every now and then? Like what if like a bug came up and stole her leg and you had to like chase after that bug? You're like, hey, get back here. Give me that leg. That'd be annoying, but it'll also just be interesting. Just add more to the game. Or maybe that could be like a modifier. Like a like um the bugs just like like to destroy Molly and you have to always chase after them and repair her. Oop. I hear a whale. I hear a detonator. <laughs> here, guys, come here. <laughs> yeah, guys, yeah. <laughs> come out. Hey, Bosco. Can you uh, stop? Here, stay over there. Yeah, stay over there. Get slowed. Yeah, just stand right next to the radiation. Why don't you detonate? <laughs> yeah, I don't. I don't think you enjoy. Yeah, I didn't I didn't think you enjoyed that. <laughs> wow, he died so fast. Well, this is critical weakness, and I do have Big Bertha. <laughs> uh that poor detonator. Woo, I hear you. Ah! We got a hell of a blimp heading your way, team. Get ready. 
Uh, usually, usually I don't expect uh, a leech. Oh, another one. No more leeching on me. <laughs> no me. Here, hold on. Wall of fire. Ah, oh, I just dropped that around my face. <laughs> That's my bad. Stave. 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 Oh, I, ju I just killed my Steve. <laughs> Whoops. My bad. Pop. Oh. Okay, I, I killed that. Good. Oh. Uh, Steve. I keep forgetting I'm on, uh, critical weakness, so I just wreck everything. <laughs> uh, radiation pool. Uh. Oh, yeah, kill, kill the bugs. <laughs> kill the bugs for me. Yeah, yeah, just stay over there, oppressor. Just stay over there, why don't you? <laughs> Whee! Stop bullying Steve. Stop it. <laughs> Bruh. Where are you? No. <laughs> you know, what would have really been good is Dark Morkite. <laughs> that would have been really good by now. Go on, go on, maybe, maybe, maybe. There you go. Oh, don't fall down there. Oh. You. I got the cave leech. Uh, uh, cave leech. Oh, yeah, <laughs> oh whoops. <laughs> I accidentally moved my mouse over there. I, I, I hit my mouse against, um, I saw that. There it is. I hear a meatball. 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 Nerd. <laughs> I'm almost out of ammo, actually. Might have to call a resupply in the next cave. Oh, dang it. I was really trying to sneak around that. Oh, uh, man. Oh, yes. Yes. Just rags, dude. <laughs> Yeah, huh? What? <laughs> Get out of here, you small ambush. You know what I should have done? I should have just threw a, uh, an incendiary grenade down on it. That's what I really should have done. <laughs> is that Steve or is that? Oh. It's real. <laughs> I think Steve may have died. Why didn't I hear the dwarf go, no, my bug. <laughs> Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that just wrecked everything. Oh, is that just the... That might just be the... Those guys. Oh, nope. Heard that. There you are. Aha. Guy to the radiation, boys. <laughs> I can't tell if uh, the radiation is actually helping or not. Oh, I, I, I still, still have a Steve. Where, where is he? He's stuck. He's a bit. He's a bit of a big boy. <laughs> and you're still alive. Well done. Whoa! I was vibing. <laughs> uh, vibe check. You have failed the vibe. <laughs> now you die. Yep. You. <laughs> now you're dead. Oh, there's another one. I really... Ah! Uh, I'm really short. Got it. <laughs> oh, hi, Warden. Hi. Well, now that you've shown yourself, you can die. You can die. No, nope. you can die. <laughs> That's how that works. This is this is the relationship we have here, Warden. You show yourself, and then you die. At least we don't have to haul all these minerals around ourselves. True. We've finally found one good reason for why Molly is here. She holds all the minerals. <laughs> Glad I ain't the one to sort it out. <laughs> I think that's one of the lines. Another one is like, ah, damn. I think I dropped my keys in there. 
I hear bugs. Oh, I hear more than just bugs. I hear scary bugs. <laughs> Here, incendiary grenade. Oh, I keep driving that on myself. <laughs> yeah, walk through it. Walk through it, bugs. Walk through it and see what happens. Do I still have a Steve? I do. Where the hell is my Steve? Steve, you're just stuck somewhere. Hey, you're being really loud, and I don't need that right now. <laughs> Fire. Yeah. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. You know, I keep looking at all these guards, and I'm just like, where's my Steve? Where's my Steve? Literally, it was just like at a dirt patch that I just didn't mine wide enough for him. Which is my bad. My bad. I thought Steve could climb over it. I guess I was wrong. Uh. <laughs> Oopsies, I picked up another mineral. Here you go, Molly. <laughs> like how sometimes you just hear the ricochet noise, like, meow. You just summed it up perfectly, Gunner. Yeah, cool. Let's get out of here! <laughs> <laughs> the music is just so good, dude. Uh, love it. I think my most favorite OST from this game is A Distant Terror. Definitely. Hey. What is that? What was that I hear? Yeah, that's what I thought. I'm both going to be the first and last dwarf, so I I pay for the beer any, either way. <laughs> I wonder where the hell Steve is. <laughs> Steve's just been gone this entire game, dude. Fire. Steve, are you over here, buddy? Are you, are you like, stuck in like the first cave? <laughs> Steve, buddy, are you stuck up here? Steve, what? Where's my bug? Where'd my bug go? You're not Steve. Aw. Well, well. Bye, Steve, wherever you are. What the? <laughs> Y'all saw that, right? A man crawled right in the drop pod with me. <laughs> Bro really thought he was gonna come to the the, the launch bay. <laughs> the space rig. That's what it is. Nice. 335. Holy crap. Only one down, too. Where did Steve go? <laughs> Steve straight up just clipped into the wall and he just vanished. Anyways, though, this is a really, really fun build. I, I highly recommend anyone to try out this Big Bertha build and for anyone to try out uh, the Magic Bullets build as well. If any anyone has unlocked these overclocks recently, try them out. They are so much fun. And if anyone has any recommended builds, um, comment them down below and I can I'll even try them out uh, on like deep dives and stuff like that. Anyways, though, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Leave a like if you didn't subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Rockin' Stone, miners.